everyone welcome back to my channel I'm Mariri and today in this video we will be playing this legendary game I definitely think it's a legendary game called Stardew Valley it's been around for quite some time and I'm sure a lot of you guys that come here to watch this already had the pleasure of trying this game playing this game and maybe investing your time in this game for years but not me I'm, I'm sad to admit this but I haven't tried playing Stardew Valley at all so this is definitely going to be one of the very first and blind gameplay of me playing Stardew Valley <laughs> so I think on that note let me apologize beforehand if there is or there are something some mistake that I would make just think of me as your student that's still confused about everything trying to understand everything <laughs> please bear with me but yes let's just jump into the game oh there is a character customization okay i haven't seen this screen i mean i know you can make your own character in this game but i haven't seen such a detailed character customization option this is very detailed wait let me oh no this is going to take me a very very long time but for now let's just establish some things before we get into the game more let me establish something like my name we are definitely going with yeah the old and traditional my name my favorite thing of course if any of you not know let me tell you my favorite thing in this world is milk it's not that it's milk okay and farm name Oh, I, I suck at naming things, honestly. Um, for farming, you know, I like milk and I think I would definitely want my farm to be named after things that I like. So this is not going to be a very creative name. Okay, milk farm. Riri and her milk farm. That's good. I like it already. Also, mm, oh, wait. There is multiple, there's different type of farm. Can we choose one of them? Ah, uh, I don't think, I don't think I would want to try out things. For now, I'm definitely a novice in this one. So I'll just go with the standard farm. We will just go with the default one. We will start like how everyone else starts. I mean, there is no way I want to start in the middle of a forest or even in the wilderness full with monster now this is Tardew Valley not Elden Ring okay animal preference so I can choose between a cat and a dog and there are different types of cat different types of dogs I think I would go with cat although if they were to add another option like maybe animal preference would be a duck I would choose that I would definitely choose that. Alright, for the other things, I'm afraid that I'm going to pause this here. I I do tend to take a long time choosing hair colors, shirt, pants, accessories. I'm, I feel like it's going to take me a long time to choose. So yeah, I will be seeing you after I manage to dress myself up. Okay, even though we are going to farm, we're going to farm with style. Okay? Alright, I I can't achieve the same pink color though. Oh, who is this? Oh, our grandpa? And for my very special granddaughter, I want you to have this sealed envelope. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 don't throw it to the screen, Grandpa. Okay, I, I got this. I got the mail with me. I can't open this one. Oh. Alright. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. I'm sorry, Grandpa. I think it's now. 
I think right now I feel crushed by the modern life. Can I just open this letter already? Oh, and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my dear, you will be ready for this gift. Grandpa, I'm sorry to break it to you, but I'm already burdened by the modern life. It's a perfect time for me to open the letter now. Uh, okay. Doja. Doing as thrive. Ooh. I know, I know how that sounds like. That's definitely a slogan that one of the modern company will use in this day and age. Life's better with Doja. Oh yeah, that's me. That's me in front of my Windows XP computer. <laughs> oh, the monitor. It's so nostalgic. I think right now a lot of monitors is just so slim. Like a slim monitor. We no longer have monitor like that. Okay. I want to ask why would we put something precious like grandpa's letter in our office desk. I mean, someone can walk in and just take out the letter, read the content, without us even getting the chance to read it first. Can I wait tap on anything else? No? Alright, let's just open the letter. Ooh! Grandpa, you had a nice handwriting. Dear Riri, hi Grandpa! Thank you for mentioning my name. If you are reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I had lost sight of what mattered most in real life. Oh, in life. <laughs> real connections with other people and nature. So I drop everything and move to the place I truly belong. I have enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy. That's excuse my grandpa, that's my farm, that's my pride and joy. Not you. I mean, I named the farm, not him. But yes, it's Milk Farm, our pride and joy. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. Okay, I thought, I thought, as someone who haven't played the game, I thought that Stardew Valley actually is the name of our farm. But apparently it's just the location where our farm is located. This was my most precious gift of all and now it's yours. I know you will honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. <laughs> the underlying message of this letter is that you take my farm and make sure you don't ruin my reputation, dear. Okay? My reputation there, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright. Ah, uh, if Louis is still <laughs> alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Excuse me, Grandpa, I mean... This is not a good thing to say for your granddaughter to check up on your friend. Also, don't call him old. I mean, you are probably the same age, Grandpa. Alright, we're on our way to Stardew Valley. Riding a bus. Enjoying the mountain view. That's a lot of mountain, though. Will we ever get the chance to explore that? Is that why it's called Stardew Valleys? Because it has a lot of valley? Hi! Hi, bird! Stardew Valley 0 0.5 miles. Oh, is that the sound of the bus? That's a fantastic sound of a bus. Alright, let me take a look. Uh, this is the main road leading to the town, I think. I don't know what that box over here does. That looks strange. Also, okay, we meet our first resident, Robin. Oh, she's beautiful. Hello, you must be Riri, that's me. 
Definitely me. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Maya or Louis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. Wait, Louis is our grandfather's friend's name, right? Louis, he asked us to check up on Louis, right? Well, Grandpa, probably your friend is still alive and kicking and he is a mayor of the town, apparently. Wait, wait, uh, is our grandfather deceased now? He's there right now, fi uh, tidying things up for your arrival. Okay. Robin the local carpenter. So she has a hobby of currently causing the deforestation. The farm's right over here if you will follow me. Let's go, let's check out our farm. I want to see how it looks, the default plan. Also, I'm really sad because I spent, I think I spent 10 or 15 minutes on the character customization screen. I tried to achieve the same pink color for my hair, but I think I just sucks in choosing color. Especially when it involves like 3 bar of saturation, RGB contrast. I, I can't achieve the same pink color for the hair, so it looks like a little bit purplish. I do hope that we can change the hair color or the outfit later on though. I don't know, maybe. Maybe. Just, just crossing my fingers and hope there is a feature for that. Alright, this is Milk Farm. Please say it with a lot more cheerfulness, Robin. This is my pride and joy. Although, it does look a little bit... <laughs> oh! My characters even jump in shock. I like that. I like that animation. What's the matter? Um, look around you, miss. You can see all that grass. Oh... Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there is some good soil underneath that mess. I think I know what she means. She is trying to tell us that we are going to have to take care of all this mess. That's fine. That's fair. With a little dedication, you will have it clean up in no time. Yeah. Grandpa, I see what you are doing. I see what you are giving me tasks to do. That's a lot of grass, wood, stone. That that that, that much that amount of grass can get me like three or five wild Pokemon, you know. And here we are, your new home. Oh, that looks cozy, actually, in my opinion. Oh. Oh, this is Louis. Hi, Grandpa Louis. Ah, the new farmer. Please, please say it like, ah, my grand, my friend's granddaughter. Would be helpful, would be much better than the new farmer. I, I don't even know what I want to do here. Like, what if I move in here and suddenly I want to become a florist, but everyone already knows that I'm a farmer. Welcome, I'm Louis Mayer of Pelican Town. Oh, you are a successful one, Grandpa! <laughs> and... wait... Mm. What's this box? What is this box? I'm... What is this box? I'm still looking around, trying to understand a lot of things. You know, everyone's been asking about you. That's good to hear. I'm glad everyone's asking for me. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Alright. So, you are moving into your grandfather's old cottage. Also, we haven't been given the name of our grandfather. I would have liked to call him other things than just grandpa. It's a good house. Very rustic. <laughs> 
Is that some kind of way to try to soften things up for me, Grandpa Louis? Although for my taste, it's it's cozy in my opinion. <laughs> Rustic, that's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt though. Robin! <laughs> I just move in. Please have some mercy on me. Let me appreciate the things that Grandpa have left behind for me. See, even Grandpa Louis is scolding her. Ruth. Ruth, Robin. Very rude. Don't listen to her. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Oh, you, you sell house upgrade? We can upgrade house? How big can I make my house? <laughs> Robin! She's cute. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. That's what I'm planning to do as well, Grandpa. I would take that suggestion. Thank you. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Okay. Thank you, Grandpa. Thank you for the house flipper job that you did before I come here. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. This box. This wooden box. So I just place anything in it and you will come get it. Why at night though? I mean he should be grateful that he's the mayor of this town. Everyone knows him. And everyone knows that he is too kind for to be a thief because if I see someone walking into someone's house in the middle of the night and then opening what presumably box filled with things that they want to sell, I would think that he's a thief. It's a good thing he's the mayor in this town. I mean, that's, that's, that's definitely sounds like a thief, you know? Well, good luck. Thank you, Grandpa. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Bye, Grandpa. Bye, Robin. <laughs> Wait, is that chicken sound? Is that the rooster sound? Oh my god, that's so realistic. As someone who lived in as someone who lived in a country filled with rooster, I mean you can see rooster everywhere you go here. That's a very realistic sound. That's one of the sound that I will hear in the morning coming from a neighbor from my root my neighbor's rooster. That's a very realistic sound. I appreciate that. Alright, new day, new me, new place, new me, a new tool set. I have a tool set. Alright, I have a series of tool equip as well. Let me check out my cabin, my wood cabin. <laughs> Wait, don't hack the floor. It's made from woods, okay? Don't make a hole in that floor. So, I just press left. Click. Oh, okay. Stop. Stop. Don't. St don't start making holes. Okay. We don't have enough money to pay for the repairing bills. Wait. Um. X hole. All right. So left click is for me to. Okay. Let me figure things out first. Um. A TV. What can I watch on the TV? Wait. We have weather report. Fortune Teller, Living of the Land. Okay, we have three channels right now. I think we will go first with Fortune Teller. <laughs> Welcome back to Felwick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you have come to the right place. Okay. The spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Luck will not be on your side. Oh no. I don't like that. 
I don't like that. Why why do you have to make a fortune teller channel? I don't like that. Also, what's the function of that channel? Do I need my luck for something? Is there an RNG in this game? I don't know, but why would I need a fortune teller to tell my luck if they will not have an RNG feature in the game? Okay, what is this? Welcome to Living Off the Land. We are back again with another tip for you all. Now, listen up. Okay, I'm listening. This one is for all you greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forage to earn some cash while waiting on your first harvest. Chop woods, okay? I got myself a nice little axe for that. We can definitely do that. Thank you, Television Grandpa. Again, I don't know his name, so I'm just going to call him Television Grandpa. Alright, last is the usual weather report. You are always going to need this, I think, in every farming game. Weather is your friend. When you are playing farming game, weather is your friend. Weather is your fate. It decides what you are going to do the next day. Welcome to Kozu 5, your number one source for weather, news, and entertainment. Unfortunately, the only channel available from Kozu 5 in this television is weather. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. That's nice to hear. Thank you. Alright, I don't think we have a kitchen. I think that's a feature that we have to buy from Robin. Uh, what else can I do? Wait, what is this box? Wait, uh, I don't want to look at the television. What is this? Oh! Parsnip seeds. Okay. You receive 15 parsnip seeds. Seeds, here is a little something to get you started. Mayor Laris. Thank you, Grandpa Luis. Parsnip. Okay, parsnip seeds. I can just immediately put it on the land here. I think I need to till the soil first. Excuse me? Where should I put these seeds? Excuse me? Oh, maybe I can just change to... Wait, how do I... Huh? Scrolling things change you to... Oh, scrolling change tools that you equip. Okay, so I can just... Or I can just pick one of them using the keyboard, I think. Alright, so if I want to start around... Okay, I don't know. I can get on with... Planting, I can start planting right now, but I already promised Grandpa Luis that we will walk around town. But I want to check out my farm first. The first thing that I want to get to know is my own house, okay? My own farm. And after that, we will go check out on the townspeople. Alright, let's go. I think... Let me... Wait, is this all just farm? Wait, I can't... Okay, let me walk around. Excuse me, excuse me. I want to take a look at things around. Oh, it's a very rundown house. Can I repair this later on and maybe live here? What is this? There is a slight hole on the... We're out from here. Thank you. We're out from there. It's dark. It's very dark. And it's definitely the setting that I don't want to see right off the bat. Okay, we're going to explore that. We are going to go there when the time is right. Basically, when the game forces us to do so. Oh, wait. Is that, is that the main road that we just came from? There is a main road over there. I like the music. 
It's very homey, cozy. Okay, there's someone here. Excuse me, Grandpa. Are you one of the townspeople that I can talk to? Grandpa Linus. Oh my god, so many grandpa. A stranger? Hello? That's all? No, no more introduction like what you do for living? Are you living in this pen? Excuse me, Grandpa. I need more information. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. Okay, that, that answers some question. And, oh gosh, there are a lot of grandpa in this house. Not this house, this town. Assuming that my own grandpa is deceased right now. Well, I lost one grandpa and then suddenly I gained a lot of grandpa in this town. Okay? Sorry for intruding on your private space, Grandpa Linus. I'm having a hard time remembering his name. I don't know how many people that I have to remember. The names, I don't ha know how many names that I have to remember in this game, but I'm trying my best. Alright, what is this place? Oh, there's Robin down there. Wait, what is this? Uh, excuse me, uh, no. I, 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 unconsciously, I want to zoom in. And a lot of games that I play, if you want to zoom in, you have to scroll the mouse. And that's what just happened. Because I was so shocked to see this statue here. What is this? Is this an animal? It's an animal statue. What kind of animal? A raccoon? Bear? A raccoon, right? It's it's it looks like a raccoon. It looks like a raccoon statue. Is there a raccoon god in this place? Oh, who are you? Excuse me. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Okay, nice to meet you. Thanks for introducing yourself. I haven't introduced myself. Okay, Robin, who is this? Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. So far, I've just met Grandpa Linus and Demetrius. Oh, their name rhymes. Okay, I'm sorry, Robin. I don't know how many people I have to meet that will have to wait. I'm trying my best to talk to everyone, though. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter Maru? She's interested to meet you. No, not yet. I haven't met Maru yet. Wait, who are you? Who are you? Excuse me? Sebastian? Alright. Oh, is this Robin's house? Uh, there is a sow. Yeah, this is a sow icon, right? A chainsaw? No, no, not chainsaw, but it's a sow, I think. And it reminds me of woodcutter, so maybe this is Robin's house. Oh, you just move in, right? Cool. That's all? That's all the greetings that I got? I mean, Grandpa Louis says that everyone's excited to meet me, but... Out of all the places you could live, you choose Pelican Town? That's... Um, excuse me, isn't this the place where you were born, Sebastian? Where did you get born and... Why why are you asking me things like that? Oh, 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 oh I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I did not realize I got the whole equipped. I'm so sorry, that's... Uh, how do I close this up? Can I just uh, hold these things again? Oh no. How do I close this up? Excuse me? Um, Robin, I'm, I'm sorry this piece of land here got destroyed because of my carelessness. Why are you looking at me? Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry, Robin. Please don't be mad at me. I, I will find a way to... To make it up to you, I'll find a way to close this piece of land later on. Wait, I see someone. Excuse me? No, why are you? <laughs> I accidentally...
accidentally click left click again. Oh, it's locked. Okay. So each place has got their own opening hours and closing hours. And now I got... <laughs> I got to destroy plan. I'm so sorry. Everyone who lives in this house, I'm so sorry. I will try to find a way to make it... To make it up to you. I'll try to find a way to close this piece of land. Oh my god, I destroyed... I destroyed them all. Oh my god. Wait, this house is right here. And I'm pretty sure... Wait, this is the sign. Oh my god, it's so dark. I want to go back to my house. Is this the road? Oh gosh, it's so dark. I can't see anything. I don't know where I'm going. I think this is the... Oh yeah, this is the main road. Yeah, I, I remember this place. I remember this area. Alright, I'm back to my old dilapidated farm. Excuse me, oh my god, this is so dark. I think the first thing that I want to build, if I can build them, is a lamb. It's too dark and oh my god. Okay, I'll just go back home. Even the interior is dark. We don't have lamb here. We don't have lamb. Oh my god, this is so dark. It's like Cabin in the Woods Season 2. I don't want that. I don't want this. I don't want this. Uh, oh, yeah. It's a good thing I remember that we can turn on the fireplace that will help light this cabin up. No more Cabin in the Woods. I'm happy. Alright, it's 11 p.m. What can I watch on the TV? Another fortune teller? Ah, I sense that a new viewer has joined us. A young lady from St Stardew Valley? How did she know? Did she track my TV? Is she an FBI? Undercover FBI? Are you a stalker, ma'am? Yeah, uh, welcome, welcome. Uh, thank you for welcoming me. It's not a good feeling to have when... Yeah, okay, it's the same luck. Although with a little act of greetings. Like, she wants to... She wants me to know that she knows where I am. That's a very threatening words, ma'am. I wish you luck on the channel. Okay, go to sleep for the night. Let's sleep for the night. Alright, let's just sleep. Oh, I think the progress is saved daily. I think your progress has been saved. Alright, after what? <laughs> what might be a first disastrous day? We're going to... Wait, I want to start working on my new farm. But first, I want to go back to where I last basically uh, destroyed a patch of land in front of the carpenter's house, I think. In front of Robin's house. And I want to make sure that it's Maybe, I'm just hoping that maybe it's going to be magically fixed or it's going to be a permanent stay. If, like, if that patch of land is going to stay forever destroyed because of what... Thank God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Thank you! Thank you, game! Thank you! Thank you so much! I thought that I destroyed the town accidentally on my first day. Like, I, I was going around trying to be friendly, trying to get to know everyone in town, and then I just accidentally destroyed their land. Destroyed their, yeah, their patch of land. I would feel bad for doing that. Okay, bad hoe. Bad hoe. Alright, let me get back to my farm, and I want to explore a little more. Oh my god, this... Oh, this farm is huge, okay? This is really huge. This is very, very huge. I heard from my friend. I talked with my friend about this game. And my friend already played this game for some years. I think... Yeah, my friend is in year two. Already? Wait. Huh? 
Wait, wait, wait. Isn't this a sequel? <laughs> oh my god! Oh no! Oh my god! It's a big axe! It's not a sequel! The sequel is the one beside it! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, I should have been weeding out grass using this instead of pickaxe. So that's why the animation looks off. That's why it's like... It's, that's why it it's looks like you are... Yeah, it's supposed to use... It's supposed to be used for mining. And instead, I'm using it to chop grass. Oh my god. So that's why... Wait, let me... Let me try. This is very embarrassing. I mean, I already gave out warning in before I start recording. I already gave out the warning in the title screen that I'm a very beginner in this and I might make mistake. But ah, uh, yeah. So I was supposed to use this sickle to cut the grass. So it's actually removable. I can't remove it before because I used a pickaxe instead of sickle. It's not meant to take out grass. Oh my god. I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> I'm out of here. I'm out from here. Wait. I'm out from here. Oh my god. This is very embarrassing. Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. A few moments later. Okay. Okay. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> a rookie mistake, okay? It's a rookie mistake, all right? It's a very, very rookie mistake, okay? I hope you guys will forgive me for this, all right? And let me just chop the grass using this. Oh my god, and the sickle actually is very efficient. It like, it weeds a lot of grass in one swing. Well, when I'm using the pickaxe, it's a very tiring job. Like, yeah, that's just one out of time. Oh my god, if I did not accidentally mine a rock, I wouldn't know that I have been using pickaxe all of this time. And it's already been like, what, 30 minutes in the recording? And I just found out that I have been using pickaxe to cut grass. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. All right. All right, all right, let me weed out these small patches of land. I can actually relate to my character when she looks really surprised because I understand how it feels. Wait, there's a letter? Uh, hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you, Willy. Who's Willy? I don't know who is him. Who are you? He should have given a lot more context. Like, who is he? My grandpa says I'm not supposed to go to someone stranger's house. To a stranger's house. Or agree to meet up with a stranger. Especially when you meet them through mailing. Online mail, same thing, okay? Alright, it's 3 p.m. and I don't know where the road to the beach. Is there a map? Wait, I think I see a map. Yeah. Alright, so oh my god. How oh, this time when I could have make it easy for me just by looking at this thing. Let me look. Oh, there is a range. And apparently in the map you can see the opening and closing hours for each place. That's useful. Very useful. Alright. Graveyard? Wait. Beach should be down here? I think this is the beach, right? Because this looks more like a lake near the mountain. Alright, so it's the southern most of the map. We will go south. We shall go south as the map dictates. Uh, there is a sewer? Wait. There is a sewer. Oh, it's locked. We can't enter that one. I'm sad. Alright. Oh, who are you? Can I get introduced to you? Elliot. Okay. Ah, the new farmer we have all been expecting. 
acting and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. Excuse me, sir, I'm just a normal vampire moving in to live a domestic life in this town, not someone who is going to land on the moon. I'm Elliot, I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Ah, thank you, that's nice to know. Which means that if I go straight from here, I got to see the beach. And yes, here it is. Oh, another grandpa. This town definitely has a lot of grandpa. Okay. That's fine though, it's alright. I like being everyone's granddaughter. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. Thank you, sir. Although I would have liked it if you add more details to your letter. Okay? Don't don't say things like we are chatting on Facebook Messenger. Ah, I'm still trying to unwin from a mount out on the salty seas. Ah, is he a fisherman? Yeah, it was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Is he going to give us a fishing rod so that we can fish as well? Finally save enough to buy me a new rod. Okay, sorry. You are taking up my time here and you are asking me to come to the beach just for you to flex on your new rod. Is that it? Ah, here. I wanted to have my old fishing rod. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive and... Hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. So you are making me, you are turning me into your potential customer. Okay, good business, good marketing. <laughs> look, at, look at my character. She's holding the fishing rod like she's been bestowed something. Like she's holding a very overpowered weapon. Is this a fishing rod? Okay, it's not like it's a Poseidon's uh, trident. Yeah, I was about to say four there. Oh, wait, there is a, a statue again, but this time it's like a bird? A bird statue? What can I do with you, though? Oh, no, no, don't fish here. Don't fish here. It's a bird. You can't fish a bird, okay? It's called fishing, okay? Because you have to catch fish using that fishing rod. Not birding rod. Wait, who are you? Can I talk to you? Penny. Oh, she's beautiful as well. Everyone in this town looks beautiful so far. <laughs> Hello, I'm Penny. That's it? Uh, you don't want to talk anymore with me? No? Alright. Wait. I haven't been to this part of the town. Can I go? The star... Oh, there are a lot of people. This is nice. This is really nice. The songs is good. I like the music. Okay, who are you, sir? Uh, I'm Clean. Okay, nice to meet you, Clean. I'm the town blacksmith. Oh, if you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Thank you. I thought blacksmith is going to upgrade the weapon. Who are you? Pam. Take it, the name's Pam. Nice to meet you. Hey, Goose, give me another round. Oh, oh, I just realized. Uh, excuse me, are you the owner of this place? Yeah. Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Oh, please relax and enjoy yourself. I think this is like a tavern, a bar, a pub. Oh my god, the music's addicting. I want to talk to you. Who are you? Emily! 
Oh, I can read it on your face. You are going to love it here in Pelican Town. Thank you. If you are ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Yeah, we know that. I mean, we're here. In the saloon, and I see you working. Okay, one more person. Who are you? Shane? What? What do you want? Go away. Very... Oh, very friendly. No more? I can't talk to him no more? Alright. Oh, it's a barrel full of drinks. And there is a game arcade. They have a billiard here. Very fancy. Let me go first to my farm. We are going home. See, it's so dark. I need light. Okay, I need lamp. Or maybe fire. I don't know. And I need to sell things on my inventory. Oh, wait. I just remembered. Wait. Excuse me. I remember Grandpa. Oh my god. It's open by itself. And when it's open by itself at night, it's scary. Okay. See? Oh god. I hate that creaking sound. Oh my god. It's brilliant. Oh, it's wonderful. Alright, let me just sell things that I had in here. Okay, fiber, clay. I think I'm going to need them. Wait, sardine give me energy and health? I do have health. Oh, there is an energy bar here. Wait, what's that sound? I'm not liking it here. Let me just go back first. Stop closing and opening by yourself, okay? I, I don't know if I appreciate the automatic feature of that box opening and closing when we get near it. But, ah, alright, a little Netflix before we go to sleep, okay? Yes, welcome to Kozu 5 again and again. What about the weather forecast? Oh, it's going to rain all day tomorrow. That's actually a perfect time for me to plant these parsnip seeds, I think. Because I don't need to water them. The nature will water them for me, right? So I think I will plant parsnip seeds tomorrow. And let's just go to bed for now. Yes, go to sleep for the night. Yes, we are turning in. Oh, can you hear that? I like the sound. I like the ambience it provides. It definitely feels like I'm in my cabin, huddling in my bed, and then there is a rain pitter pattering outside of my window. I like that. I like the sound. Oh, it's raining really hard right now. Alright, let me start. It's still in the morning. Wait, there is another meal? Huh? Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. <laughs> that's... that's me. Does this sound like you? That's 100% me. What's that sound? What is that sound? That is not the sound that I would like to hear in the early morning when I want to start my day. Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon! Ah, how do you know that I need a new backpack? Is everyone in this town a stalker? Why do they know what I... What's that sound? Oh my god! Honestly, what is that sound? What's that sound? How do I find out what's that sound? But I, I have job to do. I'm a lady on a mission. What is that? Why are you holding that? You found a diode? Diode? The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what might be hidden inside? I thought that's a geodude. dude. But that's a Pokemon. Okay. 15 parsnip seeds. All planted. Okay. I did a good job, okay? I have to report to Grandpa Louis and told him that I planted the seeds that he gave me later on. But for now... Okay, I do want to clean up the farm a little bit. 
I do want to clean up. Okay, what's that sound? That's that's very uncomfortable. What is that sound? Wait, let me check. What is this? What is this? And this? And uh, well, this is a a clock, but I don't know what this one is. Saloon, I have been there refer Oh, this one. Pierre's General Store, home of Pierre, Caroline, and Abigail. Huh? Wait, open on 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., but it's closed on Wednesday. And you know what day it is? It's Wednesday. Perfect. You just choose the right time to close up. Okay, I'm going back to my... What is this? Can I pick this up? I'm going back to my farm, though. I'm going back to my farm. What is this, a leak? What does leak do? And... Oh, it's a tasty relative of the onion. Okay. Is that like a cooking option for me? I can cook them later on? I want to build myself a kitchen. I want to start cooking. I have seen a lot of people talking about food in Stardew Valley, and I want to try that out. Okay, can I ride the bus back now? The bus to... Calico Desert? Do we have a desert in this game? That's amazing. I never know you can have a desert in a farming game. Also, I just realized that actually behind me, I'm blocking it right now, but there is an energy bar behind me and I think whatever activities that I do using this tool like fishing, mining, chopping woods, weeding out grass, I think they took out our energy so that's why we got a lot of items here that we can eat I think to restore our energy to help restore our health although I don't see where the health bar is so far, I only see the energy bar. Who are you? Why are you out in the rain? Hey, you are the new girl, huh? I think we're going to get along great. I'm Alex. Nice to meet you, Alex. Why are you here? Out in the rain? Why, why are you out in the rain? You are making our first meeting. Looks a lot like K-drama, okay? With rains and maybe a little more Korean music. It's going... Yeah, to make it looks like a K-drama greeting scene. I'll see you around, yeah. Goodbye. I see another person moving here. Can I talk to you? Oh, you are that guy that I meet in the pub. In the saloon. Hmm, this weather makes me thirsty. I know where you are going. Star Drop Saloon, right? Oh, wait. There is a guy over here. I think this is Harvey. Wait. Yeah, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Nice to meet you as well, sir. Everyone's going to the saloon? Wait, who are you? Oh, really? <laughs> Some fish come and go with the seasons, others only come out at night or in the rain. Alright, so are you saying that I should go fishing? That's okay, I can do that. Or I can't. I don't have the inventory to do that. I'm sorry. Let me go back, put things inside my box, and then I will go find some place to fish, okay? I will fish in some other place later on. I want to know. What kind of fish that I will get if I fish in my own farm? Can I, can I do that? I want to know what happens. Okay. I think someone's, some fish is biting the bait. Alright. Alright. Oh, driftwood. I don't know what that is. A piece of wood from the sea, but it's just a small pond. How can a wood from the sea, wrong, come into my pond? Okay, as usual, you are showing off your neck of locating my location. Oh my god, where's my luck? Why do I have 
Oh my god, I have the very, very bad luck. Is that all you have on your channel? You not you don't have any other dialogue than me being a very unlucky person? Oh my god, wait. Okay, let's leave for the night. Let's go to Pierre's house. Pierre's shop. Pierre's market. Pierre's flash sale. I forgot the name of his shop. Let's go. Also, I just... I think I missed out on that question mark. There is a question mark in front of the store. Let me check. Let me check. Wait, wrong. Alright. Ah, this is the calendar for this season. Yeah, the season is spring. Four, five, six, seven. And on the last day of this week, we will have Louis' birthday. I'm happy. I'm I'm happy that we got a calendar filled with everyone's birthday so we know when their birthday is. And I think we can give them a gift for their birthday. Maybe I I think that's the reason you would have a birthday calendar. Hello, Pierre. Have we met before? Okay, what are you selling? Parsnip seeds, bean starter, cauliflower, potato seeds, tulip bulbs, kale seeds, jazz seed, grass starter, grass starter recipe, sugar, wheat flour. Oh my god. You are selling a lot of things and all of them are expensive. Wait. Yeah, let's, let's get introduced to him first. Hey, it's Miss. Oh my god, he calls me Miss. Thank you. The new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. I know, I just looked through your selection of products just now. If you are looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Can I sell, uh, okay, can I sell you something strange? Oh, actually, Lick cost a lot. Lick, Lick is going to give me a lot of money as well as a daffodil. Uh, I'll just sell them for now. Okay. And where is that backpack that you promised me? You sent me an advertisement. Wait, is this the backpack? 2,000 gold? Oh my god, I don't have that much money. Can I sell my house to just exchange for a backpack? How much my house cost, actually? It's fine, I can live in the tent. I can live with Grandpa Linus in his tent. I'm more than happy to live a comfortable life with no house but 24 slots of backpack because I like to pick things a lot. Okay, gathering, gathering. My specialty is gathering, okay? It's not weeding out grass, it's not mining stone, it's not creating crops, growing crops and trees. It's gathering, only gathering, okay? I like picking on a lot of things, okay? Wait, why am I returning home? Is there anything at home that I would need to do? Well, I can... I think I can always, without, I can always clean up the farm, I think. Oh, this homey music, it's greeting me when I go home. I can always tidy up the farm or I can always find another person to bother. The game helped us. The game is actually guiding us through this feature called Journal. There is an introduction feature. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer and this is the number of how many people in town, living in town right now, 28. That means I have to remember 28 names. Whew, I'll, I'll try my best. I'll try my best to remember them all. And so far, I have greeted 16. Wow, that's not a bad number. I actually did a pretty good job with this. And there is another one. Wait. Getting started. Yes. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Yeah, use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed pocket packet 
on the tilled soil to sow a crop, water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Well, it's a good thing I'm an alumnus. I'm a veteran in Harvest Moon. I already know about things like that. So yes, I'm much more than ready to grow my first parsnip crop. And for now, yeah, I think let's just walk around town for now. I got, which means I've got around 12 people left to greet. How do I find 12 people? Oh! Mayor Lewis, hello! So, how was your first dot night in the old cottage? It feels like I'm living in cabin in the woods, sir. And, well, it's both a bad and good experience, but so far I'm enjoying it. Oh, I see a new person detected. Hello, ma'am. Why? Hello and welcome to our little community, dear. Thank you, Grandma Evelyn. Oh, you can call me Granny if you like. I will call you that. Don't worry. Alright, I've got 11 more hats to find. I'm hat hunting. Excuse me. Who are you? Can I get to know you? Yeah, my name is Riggery. Handshake. Caroline. Alright. Who else? Who else? Uh, Let's visit this place. Do you have an appointment? Appointment? Excuse me, I want to talk to you. Why are you running away from me? No. No. Talk to me. Talk to me, okay? Oh, Maru, aren't you the one who just moved in? Isn't she is Demetrius' daughter? Ah, she has such a sweet smile. I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Thank you. Uh, can I... Uh, get past you. I want to go there. I see a purple hair girl and I'm pretty sure I haven't seen her around Abigail? Abigail. Uh, okay <laughs> Actually, I don't know how to pronounce everyone's name The only name that I'm sure I wouldn't mistake saying it is only my name and my farm's name So if I make any mistake while pronouncing their name I'm sorry, perhaps you can help me by telling me in the comment section how to pronounce certain someone's name if I mistakenly saying them wrong. Oh, that's right! I heard someone new was moving on to that old farm. That's me! That's me! Oh, how much longer do you need, Doc? I'm hungry. Oh, are you having a private session with the doctor? I'm, I'm sorry to interrupt your time. I just want to find have to talk. I mean, Pierce told me to find how many, how many, how many? Okay, eight more hat to talk. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm on a hat hunting, okay? I'm going to find more hats to talk to. Uh, what is this place? What is this building? Excuse me. It's locked? Oh. And oh my god, I see a patch of land with a lot of grass. Can I help clean this one up? I think I can. Let me help clean this one. I don't know, I just want to... Oh my god, that feels satisfying, honestly. It feels satisfying when you swing this sickle. Or, or side. Yeah, I should have called it side. That's what the game says. Side. And they all just going down like that. Okay. Oh, did I already get introduced to you, miss? May I get introduced to you? Hallie. Oh. She is hot. <laughs> oh, you are that new farmer girl or whatever, aren't you? Ah, uh, that's me. That's me. Yeah, who are... Uh, uh, I'm Hallie. Nice to meet you. She's cute. I like her. Who else? Who else that I haven't met you? Who else that I should get introduced to? Oh my god, why am I back to picking things? Picking wits with pickaxe. You sighed, okay? You already know the wonders of a sight. You sighed, really? You s oh, I see someone. I see someone. I see someone on 9 o'clock. 
I'm sorry I'm creeping up behind you. Please talk to me. Oh, a stranger? How dare you? I'm not a stranger. I've already stayed in this town for four days, you know? Wait. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yes, four days, alright? Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay because I'm not a stranger and his hair is pink. I want to have the same hair color as him. How can I achieve that? Oh my god, I'm so bad at picking colors. Can I even customize? Oh, there is a grass. Excuse me, excuse me. Um, I feel like I'm turning into a gardener more and more. Wait, there is a house. Can I go in? Excuse me, anyone inside? Any hat that I can talk to and hopefully get introduced to? You? I need more hat. I can't get past this. Oh, you were not good enough with... Oh, friends with Emily to enter her bedroom. Oh, who are you? Hmm, if it weren't for those horrendous Excuse me, I will have you know I spent 15 minutes in the customization screen for this outfit. Don't you dare say that it's horrendous, okay? I'm, I'm pretty, of course, and you are pretty too. She's pretty, I'm pretty, everyone in this town is pretty. This should be named Pretty Town, not Pelican Town. Back to my hat hunting. Oh, there is... Can I talk to you? Jody. Did I already... Oh, I forgot. Oh yeah, she introduced herself, which means I haven't yet introduced to her. Nice to meet you, Jody. I'm sorry, I would have loved to stay and chat more, but I have got more hat to find... To find more people. I need to find more people. How many? Five more people. I need five more people. They should have given me a megaphone so that I can walk around town and just ask through my megaphone who wants to get introduced to the new farmer in town? Hello, mortals! You got a new farmer in town? No one wants to talk to me? There is a daffodil. Let me take this. It sells well. 20. I'm poor, so I'll just pick anything on my way that I think can be sell in PR shop or just be put in the box. No one? Uh, there are several places with question mark on it. I don't know why. But I think... I think I... Uh, wh wait, 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 what? Wizard's Tower? We have Wizard's Tower in this place. We have magic in this game. How do I go to Wizard's Tower? Huh? How do I get there? How do how do I even manage to go to a wizard's tower? Alright. And yes, uh, as I was talking before, there are three question there are question mark in this place. I think it's not accessible yet for us. And saloon, I have talked to Gus. I don't know who else living with Gus in the saloon. Pierre's, I already talked to Pierre, Caroline, yeah, Abigail, uh, Willow Lane, Jody Kent, and Sam. I think I haven't talked to them. And Marnie's Ranch, ah, yeah. I think I should try walking down here. The next day, of course, it's already night, everyone's already at home sleeping. I think the reason why they sleep so fast is because they don't have social media in this place. So they don't know what it feels to scroll down your phone until suddenly you realize that it's already morning. Like it's already 2 in the morning. But then you just keep scrolling until you fall asleep and then you just wake up to find that you are late. Either to your work to your school, to your college class. Alright, I'm just weeding out grass right now. Just spending my short time that I have in the night to clean up the grass. Since tomorrow, we will be going again to find more hat. Hat, 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 hat everywhere. Okay, I need hat. 
I need to get introduced to all of the people in town. Alright, it's already 10 p.m. Honestly, I'm very curious about the wizard's tower. But I don't know how can I get there. I'm pretty sure there is no road down here. Or is there a road? Oh my god, it's so dark. I need like, okay? I need like and there are a lot of grass around. I'm just going to keep weeding them out. Alright, alright. Alright, chop them off. Chop them off one by one. One by one. Okay, I think it's rock. I can't get past them for now. It's too dark. I can't see anything. I'm sorry. Alright, let's go back home. Excuse me, don't block my way, please. I want to go home. But before that, let's put some stuff that I think we can sell to Grandpa, which is a daffodil and a grass. Yes. Alright. Ooh, I will always get scared by that box. I don't know how long until I can get used to the feeling of having an automatic box in my house. Oh! The channel's on. Hi, television grandpa. Do you have another tip for me? This one's for you folks living in Stardew Valley. That's me. That's me, grandpa. Check for spring onions southwest of town where the river meets the ocean. You can sometimes find a whole bunch growing right out of the dirt. Spring onions. Alright, that's a good advice. What about the fortune teller? Please, no more bad luck. Huh? I see a glimmer. This is a new dialogue within my scrying orb. Make way. Make way. There is no road down here. I thought there is going to be a road down here. Excuse me. Oh, there is a road. Wait, there is a small road here. Alright. Let me read the sign. There is a farm there and... Oh, there is a road. If I take this road, will it take me to the magic tower? Wait, who are you? Excuse me? Who are you? Who are you? Oh, I'll have new items every week, so make sure to come back. Wow, you are selling me a lot of things. Unfortunately, unfortunately, I'm poor, so I can't buy anything from you, lady. I'm sorry. And we can't get introduced to her. She's not going to introduce herself. That's strange. Alright, so let me take a look at the map. The, ma the wizard's tower is actually right behind here. Can I walk through them? Excuse me. Ex oh, this is the wizard's tower? How do I get there? Wait, 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 wait. Excuse me. Wizard or anyone living in there, I'm your friendly farmer neighborhood. Oh, it's locked. You can hear someone inside though. Okay. For a situation like this, it would be best if you try bridging the connection. With an axe. Excuse me. I'm your local farmer. Neighbor farmer. Just moved in. Five days ago. I want to get to know you. Excuse me. Wizard sir. Or wizard ma'am. Please come out of the tower. I want to have a peaceful talk. Okay. I can't destroy the door. I'm sad. So I guess when they say townspeople. I think the wizard is out of the question. I think we will get introduced to the wizard later on, but for now, we should focus on finding more hats, more townspeople to talk to. Okay, this road should take me to... Yeah, this, this road, this road. They sell cow! Oh my god! That's my first step toward what is supposed to be a true milk farm. I should buy a cow later on. How much a cow costs? How much a cow cost? Oh no, I have to buy a barn first before I can purchase a cow. Which is actually valid. 
Like, yeah, you want to buy a cow, but you don't know where to put them, so you should have built them a place to live to first. Alright. Ah, Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. Nice to meet you, Marnie. Alright, that's uh, one down. Okay, how many more hats to go? Four. Four hats. Oh my god, I'm wrong. This is the door. <laughs> Alright. Four more, four more. Uh, whose house this is? Wait, I can pick this one up. I know. Um, excuse me. Oh, only Leah's friends can enter uninvited. Leah? I'm pretty sure I have never known any Leah. So the question is, where is Leah and how can I find her? I'm guessing she is the hat that I need to talk to. Who are you? Sam. Okay. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Oh, he's sweet. Nice to meet you too. Sam is trying to do a kickflip. Okay, good luck with that. I will not interfere with what you want to do. Oh, this is where you live, Granny. Okay, uh... Oh, I see someone. Excuse me, sir? George. <laughs> it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Uh, you share my mind, Grandpa George. Okay. Name's George, by the way. Now, bus off. Alright, I shall get out of your sight, Grandpa. Oh, no, I can't get... Oh, that's Alex. Okay, I, I don't want to look at your current... Attire, Alex, I did not mean to look. I'm sorry. Who's the other two, though? Wait, can I? Let me take a look. If I'm not wrong, yeah. Harvey, Louis, Pierre, and they have the single status below them. Is that like a feature? Is there like a feature where you can marry them? Is that why they put a single pack below their name? I need to find... Oh, is this the wizard living in this town? In that tower? Is that Sir Wizard? The one that doesn't want to talk to me? But I need two more. Which means that... Yeah, I don't need to know him. I don't need to get introduced to him for now. I will have to find other alternative. It's only... I think this is Leia. Leah, yeah, Leah. There, there is no Leah name. Leah and I don't know who this one is. Let me walk to Leah's cabin again. She might be around there. I mean, that's the part of the town that I rarely goes to. So she might be around here. No, Leah. Excuse me, Leah. Where are you? Are you inside, Leah? Oh my god, why are you making the house a private area for yourself? That's not fair, okay? It's really not fair. You should make your bathroom private, not your whole house, okay? And I'm back at my farm now. I want to find more town people. I'm only down to two more. Pierre? Who is staying at Pierre at this time of the day? No one. Alright. Where should I... Where can I find Leah? Should I just camp my way in the saloon? And just hope that maybe Leah is going to come here? Wait, let me look. Is there somewhere where they are going to tell me where... Oh, this is the Joja Mart. Stardew Valley Museum and Library. Wait, I haven't been here at all. Evelyn, Alex... Um, yeah. Where is Leia? Is she in that museum? Let's just make our way there. It should be past this bridge, right? Oh, wait. I found, I found you. I found you. Please stop. Please stop. Das. Okay. Ah, oh, she's shy. I can talk to her no more. No? No, you don't want to talk? Okay. That's sad though. I need to find Leia, so I'm just down to one more person, which is Leia. Leia, 
are you here? Who are you? Who are you? Excuse me, actually, who are you? I can't talk to him? Is this the wizard? Are you in disguise, sir? Gunter. Oh. Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological's office. <laughs> this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection? How could you let him do that? That's crime. We don't have any artifacts for display, but I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Ah, so I will be helping him in setting up the museum, I guess. There is a doll here? It's ragged but still cute. It's cute all the way. No, Leia, in here. Leia, where are you? Where did Leia live? It li he, she lived in the cottage, right? Or did she live somewhere? I need to catch Leia outside of her cottage. Leia! Leia, still hoping that she's going to come out at night. Leia! Leia? No, Leia? Oh my god, are you Leia by any chance? Please, talk to me. You are Leia? No, she's not Leia. You are not Leia. I need to find Leia. Leia! Oh no. No, Leia. Alright. Alright, folks, we are going home. As sad as it can be, we don't see any Leia for today. We're just down to one more person, and that is Leia, supposedly. Let me check. Yeah, one more people, and I'm presuming that is Leia because I talked to Gunther, and he doesn't count as the town's people. I think he is an outsider in this town, and it doesn't count. I think that one person must be Leia. Alright, let's spend our night before 11 p.m. cleaning up things. As usual, I will be cleaning up things for now. And I will try to find Leia tomorrow. Tomorrow, in the morning, we will come in front of her cottage with the hope that she will come out. Alright, as usual, let's tune in to the fortune teller. If it's one more bad luck, I'm quitting this town, okay? The spirit are, oh my god, are very displeased today. Why is it become more bad luck? They will do their best to make your life difficult. What did I do? What did I do wrong? I didn't do anything wrong. Well, except maybe for destroying a piece of land in front of Robin's house. But that's old news, okay? That's already on my first day. I'm a grown... I have turned into a new leaf, okay? It's already day six. Alright. Good morning, rooster. Let's run. Let's run all... Oh, wait. I forgot. Water this thing first. Okay, water the parsnip. The parsnip needs attention as well. So I have to water them as well. Okay, water. Water. Yeah, drink well, plan, drink well, and grow tall, okay? Drink well and grow tall. And sell well, please. I need money to buy a new backpack. Alright, let's run. Let's run. I hope we can catch Leia. Excuse me. A few inches later. I have been trying to find Leia, but I don't know where she is. This is day two of us trying to find Leia, but I don't know where she is. Where is she? Where could she be? I don't know. I don't even know how she looks like. Wait, who are you? Oh, Grandpa Willy. Wait, Grandpa Willy, why are you here? Can you get Leia to come out? Grandpa Willy, can you help me break the door down? Grandpa? No? Okay, fine. I'll do it myself. Where's Leia? Leia? Leia, are you Leia? No, you are not Leia. I forgot your name already. I'm sorry. I'm too preoccupied in my quest trying to find Leia. She's not living here, right? Yeah, Leia's not here. Leia, where are you, Leia? Please come out, Leia. Where can I find you, Leia? Where did she live, honestly? 
she should be living in that cottage, right? I mean, with Elliot. So wait, let me go back to the beat. Just to show you guys, because I'm pretty sure Elliot has her own cottage as well, and we can't enter them. See, this is Elliot's cottage, and as it says, it's locked, so I can't go there. I have to catch Elliot outside of his cottage, so that's what I should be doing with Leah as well. I should camp outside of her house because sooner or later she's going to come out from that house, right? All right, all right. I'm I'm going to do just that. We are going to camp outside of Leah's house, or maybe I can just join Grandpa Willy and fish here. No, I don't have enough. No, I don't have enough. Can I just drop them? No, I can't just drop them. No, I can't. I think that's that counts as littering. Okay, can you use okay Marnie, Marnie, excuse me, Marnie, can you buy my mix seed? Yeah? No, I can't sell sell her anything. If I want to sell something, I think I have to walk to Pierre's shop, but that would involve me leaving Leah's house unsupervised. I need someone to supervise this house. Okay. Grandpa Willie, I ask you this is the first favor i have asked you please watch over the house if you see Lea coming in please hold her okay i don't have a bathroom in my house i can't take a bath and whose fault is that blame my grandpa for that okay all right hello sir and grandpa louis excuse me process gyo gyots gyots yeah okay uh how just put it here. And breaking it cost me money. Oh my god. And I have to donate it to the museum if I want to. Alright. Alright. I still can't find Leia. But for now, I guess we will just donate this one to the museum. Oh, it's already playing cutscene. Abysmal? Not a single piece in the entire collection oh my god all of that i just realized that all of that table is for displaying artifacts and other historical objects and the previous curator just succeedingly make off with it what's this you found something let me see it yeah yeah take this take this away from my inventory please and if you can pay me in the process as well, I need that red backpack in Pierre's shop. It's seducing me. It's tempting me. Remarkable. It's very old. I would love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Mm, I know where you are going to, Grandpa Gunter. Just take it. It's yours. Hmm. I've got... Oh no, a favor? Would you consider donating? Okay, it's donating. Well, yeah, I just take it away from my inventory. It's fine. Take it, take it, take it. Oh, yeah? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Alright. Yeah, that's fine. If you decided to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Okay, that's what we will do. Let's go. Let's just donate this and let's go back to camping outside of Leia's house. Okay, this is what I want to donate. Yeah. Where can I... Oh, I can put this everywhere? That's cool. Um, I don't know where to put this thing. Maybe here? This is my first ever artifact. Okay, hard face here. Wait, there is a new journal. Archaeology. Oh, we get money! Gunter asked if you would consider donating any new artifacts or minerals you find to the museum. He says he will compensate you by way of occasional rare goods. Okay? I'll take it, that's fine. 
All right. This is our last try. We are going to camp outside of Leah's house for today. And if she, we can still meet her, I'm afraid I will have to end this video for now. But hopefully, I'm I'm very very hopeful that we can end this video with us meeting Leia, and that means we have met all of the townspeople. Okay, Leia, please come out. I've got a sap for you. Do you like sap? No. Leia. Okay, I'll just fish here. All oh, wrong. I should have moved a little bit to the edge. Leia, please come out, Leia. Hi, Grandpa Willy. Wrong! Grandpa Willy, move away! I'm fishing, okay? I'm fishing! Thank you! Okay. One more? Okay. Wrong. Okay, everyone, vampire number one is here, and right now, the time of us is 6 spring on Saturday, and it's almost 10 p.m., and I have been camping here for one hour, and I can tell you that there is no sign of Lea coming out of the house. I have been here pretending that I'm fishing, even though I've got no bites at all, and I'm still hoping that I can still catch some fish. Alright. I hit them. I think I have finally successfully catch a true fish. No, I have failed to catch a fish. Alright, let me throw one more. Alright everyone, this is a status update. It's already almost 4 p.m. and no Leia signs detected. I have no idea if she actually exists or not. Oh my god, that's Leia! That's Leia! That's Leia! That's our Leia! Leia, stop! Please stop! Please, please stop! <laughs> Oh my god, thank god, it's finally, it's nice to meet you too, Leia, it's really, really nice to meet you, you don't know how long I have waited for this moment for us to meet, okay? <sighs> Play that K-pop songs, please. Alright, Leia, it's very nice to meet you, you pick a good time to move here, the spring is lovely, I know, it's very lovely with all the sakura around and she's nice as well. Alright, alright. I get introduced to them all, we are finished the quest, and we get a new one, how to win friends. Giving gift is a great way to build friendship, learn each person's individual taste, and you will be popular in no time. I see. I can start giving them gift now, which is fun, really really fun. Figuring out what they want, things like that, that's really fun for me. Alright, but really, I have get introduced to all of the people in town and you are not going to give me anything at all, Grandpa Louis. I have been such a good granddaughter and you are not going to give me anything for my effort in socializing. I think I can understand why a lot of people get lazy to socialize. No, no, I'm just joking, alright. Alright, I'll just clean this farm for now. Clean everything. Alright, let me clean this one up as well. Okay, there is... Uh, wait, I can just destroy them using my pickaxe. I want to just clean them all up for now. Yeah, let me just clean them all up. Oh, your axe isn't strong enough to break this thumb. I have to upgrade them if I want to break them. Alright. Okay, let me chop down these trees. Alright, you know what? I think for now, I will just end this here. Whew, okay. <laughs> or maybe... No, I, I think, yeah... It's better for me to wait for the day to end, and then save, and yeah, that's it. Alright, let's just continue chopping things for now. 
take down this huge tree as well with that okay put my things in here i just want to sell this grass and yeah all right let's sleep let's sleep okay let's go back to my warm cabin wait one more fortune teller okay one more fortune before i ended this video please make my luck turns good oh my god it's still bad luck i'm i don't know what's wrong i don't know what did i do wrong okay all right let's sleep for the night thank you thank you i know i know i know i'm poor thank you and this is day seven all right I like that one. Alright, let me return to Typhoon and I will close the video there. Alright. It's been such a journey. I have... Whew, I've really had fun. I really, really had my fun playing. <laughs> I, I think I can see why this is such a legendary game and why everyone loves this game. It's a very wonderful game. I like how they add a farming game, but there is a little bit touch of magic in it. You got a magic tower, you got a witch, you got a fortune teller channel. Although all I've got for my luck this week is all bad luck and horrendous luck. When can my good luck come? I don't know. Also, I I really like how they got a lot of townspeople, and I think there is um a marriage feature or maybe a boyfriend girlfriend feature because most of them i think they are already married but some of them have the single status below their name so i think yeah i think we can romance them and i think it's fun i don't know who's i'm going for it's still my one week it's still my first week in stardew valley but i really really enjoy this Oh my god, I really enjoy this. Okay, guys, I think that's it. Oh, sorry, everyone. Also, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like. And I wonder what what is your first experience in Stardew Valley? How does it go? How does your first week in Stardew Valley happen? Do you do something wrong? Like something embarrassing like me? Or, or what? I want to know. So if you feel like you want to share your experience in Stardew Valley or well anything else that you want to say about this game, feel free to do so in the comment section. I will read that, reply to that. <laughs> I like you guys comment. I always like reading you guys comment. It's very positive, supportive, and informative. <laughs> Alright, I think that's it if you like watching me playing this game or any kind of games that you see me playing in this channel and you want to see me playing more of this kind of game feel free to subscribe to me it's feel free and it's free okay and yeah all right i think that's it oh, sorry everyone thank you Ta da